Coogan Cassius IFL TV here uh, in Glasgow for the press conference of the show on the 27th of June um, in Brayhead. With me I've got Stephen Simmons who will face, finally face, Wadi Camacho. How are you Stephen? I'm good, Coog, how are you? I'm alright, I'm very well. Uh, were you disappointed that your uh, opponent wasn't here today? Uh, I was I. Um, I wanted to uh, show everybody that I can remain calm in his presence and there would have been a good chance today uh, just to show everybody that he's not under my skin he doesn't bother me like I bother him he thinks about me every night before he goes to his bed cooking monster this, cooking monster that I even have given you the cookies to give them so um, I was a bit disappointed but touch on that I want to thank uh, all my sponsors uh, Giant Eye Scaffolding, Wood Roofing, Detman Fortlift Trucks uh, Scottish Solar, Trend Cloven and Select Blinds. They've been uh, top notch sticking by me while I've been injured. Um, and also I thank MGM uh, for all their, all their help and, and stuff over in Marbella. Uh, Daniel Chris and the Taffinator. Uh, it's been unbelievable. Me and Danny have been working hard over there. And Derry as well. Derry's fighting this weekend. Uh, but it's been top class, looked after and and getting my food in the slanchy as well. Unbelievable food. How's the rib injury? The rib injury is, is non-existent now. Um, done some sparring with uh, my good mate James the Gale uh, Thursday, Saturday and he unleashed some pretty decent heavy explosive body shots and not a blip. It's, uh, so in my mind it's non-existent, it's never happened. Uh, and I'm just looking forward to the, the fight now. What did you make of the statement that Eddie Hearn read out in the press conference today? The statement... From, from Wadi Camacho, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Well, the statement was a bit intellectual for Wadi Camacho. I know them words didn't come out of his mouth. It was probably blah, blah, blah. They've taken it, they've tweaked it a bit, and then Matt's written it down on a bit of paper for Eddie to read. Uh, but it was far too intellectual for uh, Wadi. But at least everybody got it to got to listen to some words and so they a lot of rubbish he did make uh, an apology over the dress comments so yeah, well, that was a positive he, he can apologise all he wants he was still taking the piss out of me doing a good deed for charity Marie Curie Cancer Care um, there was no need uh, in taking the pictures taking the piss out of the pictures I did it purely for charity and I'm, I'm blessed to have done it, uh, so he can say what he wants, the apology is not accepted and he can keep his stinking money, he's not giving me any money for the charity, he's going to need it when I retire him. And uh, what did you make of his offer to you uh, if he won the fight? He ain't getting no year buddy out of me, he ain't going to win the fight, so he ain't going to just talk to walls. Okay. We can leave that one there. Um, 27th, which is a Friday, uh, June, back in Scotland. Yep. Another huge bill. It's kind of like the same time I always interview we talk about this. It's uh, uh, a, a cracking bill, though. It's got, like I said, finally got you and Camacho on it. Also, uh, Willie Lemon's fighting, um, defending his Commonwealth yep. against Curtis's British. And Brophy, Slowey, Roberts, all on the bill. Scotty Cardle. Yeah, Very good bill. It's gonna be it's gonna be a great bill, and uh, Scotland as boxing fans are the best out there. Um, you couldn't ask for a better crowd, better support, and to be boxing in front a uh, packed crowd again in Glasgow is going to be unbelievable. There is support, and uh, I was getting for the the last the last fight I was due to fight. I'd sold 800 tickets in a week and a half. They're just getting them. Um, so I just want to thank all them guys for getting behind me last time. Sorry I couldn't fight uh, due to injury, but um, again, I've, I've took a big bulky ticket. So anybody wanting tickets, come and see me. Uh, I've got them here. You have indeed. Um, just to clear up, um, obviously the, the Scottish board had ordered you and Roddy Camacho to go in front of them. You have been, I I've believe, been. you've been... Um, the reason why Waddy isn't here today is because he hasn't attended that. So, uh, what happened at that at that uh, hearing? The hearing was just to go 
uh, listen to what they had to say, uh, take on board and apologise and basically they let me away with a warning. I believe they were going to do the same way Wadi, give them a warning uh, for putting boxing into disrespute. But things happen, it's a heated moment, the brain goes everywhere, you just get angry. So these things happen, um, but he never attended and they have them every month so he's had his chance to attend at least one of them. So you better get your bum up to Scotland, get in front of the board to make this fight happen. All right, listen, Stephen Simmons, thanks for talking to IFL TV. We uh, eagerly anticipate the 27th of June uh, when you two can finally get it on and settle whatever it is in the ring. And uh, we shall see what happens. Yep, definitely. Can't wait. All right, thank you very much. Cougan Cassius, Stephen Simmons here for IFL TV. Thank you very much.